Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yaiba Season 3 Episode 1 is literally 49 minutes long. <sighs> Amazing. Well, in Episode 1 lots people was confused in this scene, right? Who is he? Who is this guy look like Tanjiro? Why he look like the Upper Moon Demon 1, Kokowishubi, and also look like Tanjiro's father Tanjiro? What is the connection between them so confusing, right? Well, let's find out all of this. But before that, I have a small request for you. Please drop a like or a comment in this video. And make sure to subscribe Thunderpoke. Let's begin. What I'm going to about may spoil you somehow, so be careful. Well, this scene includes Yurichi Tsukikonians, Sumishio Kamado, his wife Suyako, and a baby. Fans have speculated that Sumiyashi's newborn child, whose identity is unknown, might be Tanjiro's father. But, this isn't true because Yurichi and Sumishio lived hundreds of years before Tanjiro and his father, Tanjiro Kamado. Who is Sumishio? Sumishio is an ancestor of Tanjiro who comes from the era of the first ever Demon Slayer. And this guy is Yurichi, the greatest and powerful swordsman of all time, who once saved Sumishio and his family from a demon's attack, and this scene after that happened. Yurichi apologizing to him because his wife and child are asleep was shown. Yurichi tells him not to worry and says that he shouldn't be accepting free food from him. But Sumishio rejects that and says that the he saved him and his family and is therefore always welcome in his home. He concludes by saying that even though he is just an ordinary coal burner, he will pass on the narrative to all future generations because the Yurichi does not have any children. And since that day both became friends, best friend. Yurichi is also the creator of sun breathing technique, one of the most powerful technique. Yurichi passed down his earrings to Sumishio and teach him the sun breathing technique, and that's how the sun breathing technique passing down through generation in Kamado family, and Tanjiro his father knows how to do it. Because Sumishio is Tanjiro's ancestor. That's why he looks like Tanjiro. Now why Yurichi look like Upper Moon Demon 1? Kokowishubi. Well, Kokowishubi and Yurichi Tsukikonians are twin brothers who shared a significant connection in the series. Kokowishubi, originally known as Mikachoka Tsukikonians, was a member of the Demon Slayer crew during the Heian period. He fought alongside his brother Yurichi in an effort to eradicate demons. However, due to circumstances involving Muse and Kabustui, the demon leader, Kokowishubi turned into a demon himself. He became one of the 12 Kizuki the 12 most powerful demons serving under Muzan. Kokyushio's transformation into a demon granted him immense strength and heightened abilities. He became the Upper Moon One, the highest ranking member among the 12 Kizuki. Despite his demonic nature, Kokowishubi retained his exceptional swordsmanship skills and his own unique breath style, the moon breathing technique. Here are some extra amazing info. You know, Yurichi's encounter with Muse and Kabustui was a pivotal moment in the series. Yurichi fought Muzan and managed to severely weaken him, leading to the eventual downfall of the demon. During his battle with Muzan, Yurichi encountered Kokowishubi, who was still a human at that time. Kokowishubi was deeply envious of his brother's talents and resented the fact that he could not match Yurichi's strength. This envy led to a confrontation between the two brothers. In their battle, Yurichi defeated Kokowishubi, but he spared his life, hoping that his brother would find redemption. However, Kokyushio's desire for power and his encounter with Muzan drove him to consume demon blood, transforming him into a demon and aligning himself with the 12th Kizuki. The animosity between the brothers remained, and Kokowishibi harbored a deep-seated grudge towards Yurichi. I hope now it's all clear for you. Well, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Till then bye bye and have a good day.